Hello everybody, welcome to episode 28 of Sadie Spotlight. This is your show where we look at different unique stadiums in the show. 23 and today we're at the former home of the Texas Rangers, Arlington Stadium, and this stadium was created by Layson Driver. All this cinema information will be in the description as always. You can check it out for yourself. If you enjoyed the series and want more, please consider liking and subscribing. If you have your own stadium you want me to look at, make sure you put your online ID and the name of the stadium in the comments below, and I'll be sure to check it out. And with that, let's get on with the tour. So this stadium seats 54,000 people. Down the left of the line is 320. To dead center field, it is 400, with 420 being the furthest distance in left center field. And then down the right of the line, it is 320. As you can see behind home plate, we just have a large section of seating right behind home plate. And then we have a press box at the top of it. And as you can see, we have a parking lot to right beyond the stadium entrance. A large parking lot. Let me get some light fixtures surrounding the home plate seating. And just like behind home plate, we have another large section of seating in the outfield. And it expands from foul territory down the right field line all the way to foul territory down the left field line. And then on the concourse level in left field, we do have a Jumbotron with some advertisements surrounding it. And then outside the stadium, we have a large parking lot. We got some light fixtures lighting up the stadium. And I think what the coolest thing about the stadium is that he put the construction of Globe Life Field in the background of the stadium. So in the distance, you can see him building it. And look at the detail of the stadium. Oh my goodness, it looks amazing. From a distance, it looks exactly like Globe Life Field. Even the exterior looks amazing. The, <laughs> the cranes are putting in the Jumbotron in right field on the roof of it. This just looks amazing. I love the attention detail to this one. I think he did a fantastic job with this exterior. He even put dirt around to make it look like they're still in construction. Love this detail. This is what it looks like from above home plate. This is what it looks like from above center field. And here's a bird's eye view. So that's pretty much it for the stadium. So let's go ahead and try to hit some bombs here in Arlington Stadium. So here we are playing at Arlington Stadium. Don't think we're going to be hitting Globe by Field, but goodness gracious, almost over the stands. There's like 50 rows. Oh my goodness gracious. Five, okay, 510. That wasn't even halfway out the seats in center. That's insane. The seating here was ridiculous. I mean, obviously I didn't get there, get to go to a game in person there. And... I really haven't watched much footage of like games played here, but what I've seen, the seating here was insane. I gotta, I'll put the uh, capacity of the real stadium in the description, so you can get a uh, a good idea of what how many seats were in the stadium. And I don't know what it formerly was. I don't think it was built for baseball. I'm pretty sure it was like a multi-purpose stadium. Five ten longest with Mickey Mantle. Changing it up a little bit using Mickey and Mike Schmidt. See if we can get some bombs with different players. 520, first pitch, unbelievable. That's not going to get out. 420 to left center field. Can't believe that got out. So if you're going to play at this stadium online, you better hope you don't hit it to left center field. Because it probably will not get out. So 4 already with Schmidt. That one... 502 we get bonus obviously two 500 foot bombs and I was playing and I was playing Homer Derby with some friends earlier this week and some like live series players or some players have more than 99 power but for some reason when you play like offline or I guess here it doesn't show me or doesn't adjust the power so that's pretty much it for the video today. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed the stadium, one more, please consider liking and subscribing. If you have any stadium you want me to look at, make sure to put your online ID and the name of the stadium in the comments below, and I'll be sure to check it out. And with that, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will catch y'all in the next video. Peace.